First of all, a few words about pluses and minuses of EA Sports WRC. The dream came true, and Codemasters released a rally game with official WRC license. Now we have a chance to drive all main rally cars with physics from Codemasters. It was the first plus. And second one. We were all overheated by expectation, and as a result, interest to rally in general is much bigger now. First minus. We were all overheated by expectation, and as a result, the not perfect launch disappointed a lot of people. And the second big minus. The game turned out to be too heavy for ordinary graphic cards, and at the same time, poorly optimized. On my system, the game starts to look decent after setting it up on anti-aliasing quality Epic and anti-satropic filtering 16. Also here the bug of car reflection on road surface disappears. But my graphics card occasionally freezes on object reach stages, so I play on high and 8. A judging by the review that I see, this game overall optimization is complete fiasco. The optimization of Dirt Rally 2.0 I consider to be a benchmark. The best optimization of all modern rally games. 2 out of 10 against 10 out of 10. In the comments of comparison with WRC generations, some of you wrote that the stages here are empty and boring. I think the opposite. I am very happy with the stages. The guys from Codemasters perfectly calculated the configuration of the stages in 2.0. I was always amazed how in Dirt Rally you make a maximum attack and the position of the cars goes perfectly with the continuation of the road, terrain and turns. There is nothing exceeding, all elements work perfectly. And here they did the same. Or maybe almost the same. Stage configuration 10 and 10. Stage appearance. I respect the developer's decision to switch to a new engine, and overall I am pleased with how most of stages look. Some stages are masterpieces, such as Monte Carlo stages. One of the first impressions in my career was the super atmospheric stages of Monte Carlo. Autumn Japan is gorgeous too. Who thinks the stages here are empty and boring? Try for example Manga Pai from New Zealand on wet surface, it's Oceania. It's very cool stage. However, the graphics as a whole cannot be compared to Dirt Rally. Again, even in low settings, 2.0 looks and feels much more realistic. Stage appearance 10 10. Car appearance. I'm very excited to try driving new generation hybrid cars. These cars are sorely missed in 2.0. But as a for appearance of the cars in general, the cars in Dirt Rally 2.0 definitely look better. Here, check it out. Car surfaces, reflections, everything looks so much better and more realistic. What can I say, they look just fantastic in 2.0. I think this is also a standard of quality. 9 out of 10 against 10 out of 10. Sound design. The first thing that impresses you in EA Sports WRC is intro sound. Just listen to this. It's awesome. The sound of new cars, the sound of old cars, everything is amazing. But when I'm going from WRC to Dirt Rally, I get the feeling that the sound quality and sound design in 2.0 is even better. Sound design. 10 out of 10 and 10 out of 10. Immersion in gameplay. I consider this category to be one of the most important. For example, despite the objective age-related shortcomings of the visual of the Richard Burns rally, this game still excels in this aspect. The same thing is in the case with WRC from Codemasters. Despite the bugs of the first versions and the lack of dirt on cars, the immersion in the gameplay is excellent. The specifics of different locations are fascinating. The number of cool cars is excellent. It's definitely 10. The gameplay immersion of 2.0 is also superior in my opinion. The effects of rain, water, dirt, textures, all this will complement the game engine itself so much that I experience the brightest emotions here. At least this applies to the case of playing with gamepad. After having a great time with EA, WRC and RBR, I go to the Dirt Rally 2.0 and feel like this is it. 
This is perfect gameplay. Perfect for me. Immersion in gameplay. 10 and 10. Cars physics. I think this is where the main difference lies. Yes, Codemasters transferred physics to the new engine, very reminiscent of the physics from 2.0. But there are nuances here that need to be considered in more detail. The main advantage of WRC is physics of cars on asphalt. Codes fixed all shortcomings of behavior of rear axle of cars on tarmac. And now it's more enjoyable. 100%. This is truly the strongest point of physics here. However, the main disadvantage, in my opinion, is the feeling or weight of the cars. Cars have become lighter, significantly lighter. When I play in dirt rally, I feel the weight of each car. I don't get dissonance like here or in KT games. Plus, my favorite classic cars, the Impreza and Lancer, are less comfortable to drive in new WRC game. In 2.0, I just can't stop driving these cars. So, EA WRC is much better than Kyloton games, but worse than Dirt Rally 2.0. And having played this game for a significant amount of time, having spent a lot of time trying to fix something in the game part calibration settings, I officially declare that the physics in 2.0 is much better than EA Sports WRC. Cars physics 9 out of 10 against 10 out of 10. Damage system. Finally, the WRC beats Dirt Rally. Codemasters has reached a new level when it comes to damage. Do you agree with me? You can be serious. No, they didn't. Of course not. They brought something new. Yes, now all that remains of your car is a frame with wheels. And it's pretty damn good. But damage system has lost its main feature, that physics that gives such unbeaten realism. No pun intended. And this is one of the most important features of 2.0. It's a shame that damage looks so toothless with the new engine. Damage system 7 out of 10 against 10 out of 10. General impression. Overall, I'm happy with the new game from Codemasters. It was terrible launch. But overall the game is very good. I was expecting it to be something different, not like 2.0. And I was right. I was disappointed with optimization, but this is just an additional stimulus to change my graphics card. Yep, it's high time. Like many others, I'm still waiting for the promised fixes. I'm also looking forward to Central European location, Czech Republic, Austria and Germany in autumn surroundings. Oh, it's gonna be cool. I take great pleasure in immersing myself in the world of new stages. Estonia is my favorite so far. Very speedy stages, breathtaking. As for physics, this game was advertised as being very suitable for gamepad users as well. But in reality, I hear good reviews from owner of steering wheels, but with gamepad, Dirt Rally 2.0 plays much, much better. So it's time to buy a steering wheel too. In addition, 2.0 is like RBR, legend now. And as you know, legends never die. I have a whole collection of liveries. Take a look. Can all this compete with what the new WRC game offers? It actually can, or rather WRC can compete with Dirt Rally. Because WRC has amazing customization. I really enjoyed the customization options. Yes, not everything works as expected. For example, for each side of livery you need to create everything from scratch. And funny story, sometimes it's just impossible. For example, this element. It looks great on the left side, but you can't do the same on the right. You can rotate this element, but you cannot flip it over. It's a real bummer. Despite this, customization makes it possible to personalize your favorite cars. And I like it. Extra 9 points to WRC for cool customization. The gameplay is just magical in Dirt Rally. WRC with Codemasters and EA Sports just took their first steps. Will they ever reach the level of 2.0? I hope so. I hope. General impression. 9 out of 10 against 10 out of 10. 
So much has happened in recent months. Expectation, marketing, not perfect launch, first acquaintance with the structure of new game. However, as always, everything is known in comparison. Please tell us about your impressions in the comments. Do you think EA Sports WRC is better? Are you, like me, think that 2.0 is absolute legend and so much better than this game from Electronic Arts? I wish you all the best and no matter what game you choose, have a nice stage. Small crest, I